Yeah. Oh. Oh my God. This is a hip. <laughs> Hello everyone. Today is going to be epic because I'm once again at the Audi 9s event. I'm somewhere deep in Germany in this amazing quarry and this year there's even more features. So before we get into the first day of riding, we're going to have a little look around this insane place. Let's get into it. I've come up to the very top of the quarry now. This is where the biggest line starts and you're faced with just the huge lip down there. But before you even get to it, there's the biggest drop ever. And it's not even a flat takeoff. It's like, well, it's so, I don't even want to walk down there. It's so scary. But we really need to see the size of this drop. So Max Fredrickson, who's actually holding the camera for me, is going to have to run around there now and get a shot from the bottom looking up. Max has made his way down now. Look at the size of this first drop. It is huge. And then when he turns around, you can see you fly into that first massive lip that's it's just huge. That's like a 90 foot double there. Craziness. Well, I'm down at the big lip now on this big line, but what runs through the middle is the smaller slope style line. Look, someone's getting a first hit now. Oh, look at that. Whoa, huge air. We'll get back to that in a bit though, because we need to look on the landing of this big one, because there's a huge berm. Let's look out for traffic. After the landing of that big line, you're faced with this huge berm. They've made it way taller this year. It's actually above your head, so you'll be able to get endless speed into the lower part of the course. This whole top section is a crisscross of different lines, and as Max Fredrickson's arms are so weak, he's now going to take over and tell you about the next few features. Let's get on down there. <laughs> So I'm actually very, very strong. But yeah, I'm Max Fredrickson and uh, yeah, stick to be back in Sam's videos. After the berm, you're coming out to like this humongous double here. And yeah, it's a bit hip to the left and it's insane. So next to the big line, we have the slope style line, which starts off with that flat drop, leading into a quite a nice trick putter. Nice size, playful, the dream. So right after both the big line and the slope style line, uh, after the two doubles, we're leading into two step downs. Different sizes, obviously, to different bikes, but yeah, pretty playful. Quite big as everything else out here. Sick. You can also take a second route into the skate park up here, which is going to be insanely fun to ride for us. Oh man, Eric, on course. Oh. Yeah. Oh, Fedco. No way. Well, he's just highlighted exactly the lower part of the slope style course there. Like Max said, there's two step downs, for the, one for the big line, one for the slope line. He hit the smaller option and then straight into the smaller lip there on the right. Yeah. Yeah. Flip it. Oh, yeah. Got it right. So we're in this new skate park section. This is new for this year. We've got a quarter pipe. There's real solar panels on there. So I don't know how that's going to work for wall rides. We've got a step up option and a spine there. We've got another rider coming in. Let's see if he's going to, yeah, he's coming into the skate park zone. Epic. Yeah. Oh, yes. Okay, so this is literally the first day of practice, so everyone's getting warmed up on stuff. You can also see that from last year, they've kept the big satellite dish, and from there, you'll be able to do transfer options onto the last landing down there. Basically, the dream. Let's go down there now and check out the huge big air. Yes, hugeness. We're now at the bottom of the huge trick jump landing. This is the same as last year, but as you can see, there's fresh sand on there. It's not been hit yet because it is day one. So there's definitely gonna be some landing on heads, backs, arms, and faces coming up. But because it's sand, we're gonna love it. Let's go around and see how big the lips are. I'm inside the gap now. Look how huge it is. It's insane, but this is like raised this section. So if you come down a bit further, the lip's even bigger, look. That's ridiculous. 
We're now around the front of this huge jump. The lip, well, it's just, it's like, a, it's like something you find in like one of them like assault courses where you have to try and get to the top. It's massive, look. Sam Reynolds and Clemens Cordelia have just ran up the top. They're gonna show us how much air you get on it. There's two options. You've got the huge side if you're super YOLO, and if you're half YOLO, then you've got the smaller option. That's for the jump bikes. That side's for the downhill bikes. Here we go, Clemens Cordelia dropping in to the trick jump. Oh. Oh. <laughs> Whoa, that is huge. Okay, that is the trick jump. I'm getting excited to ride now. Let's go down and look at the biggest, biggest feature that's ever been made for mountain biking. We've come over now to the most ridiculous thing ever. Get a little zoom out, Max, and we'll show you this. Look, bigger and bigger. Oh my God, this is a hip. You can go both ways. The takeoff is, well, it's huge. It's pointless to say meterage because just looking at this now, you can see that it is the craziest piece of engineering ever. These guys filled this whole bottom zone up with dirt. Then they had to pack it all in as high as the top there. Then they dug it out with two, and th well, there's three diggers working to make this happen. So hopefully it's actually good. We're gonna go around there now and look at the lip because the run up is also something as a, just, ugh, I can't even speak. I'm too excited and scared. The rolling is quite ridiculous. Like the, the first section is huge. Like if you're going full speed from that one, you'll go way too fast. And then there's a, another one that we call the YOLO section. That is, you can't even see it from, up, from down here. And yeah, basically you can get as much speed as you would ever want, more than you want for sure, into that massive kicker, which is supposed to be around six meters. I don't remember if it's 6.5 or 5.5, but I think it's around six. How small do I look if you're... <laughs> Quite scared, to be honest. Are you scared? Yes. Yeah. Humongous. So that was a little look around the Audi 9's course for this year. It is looking absolutely amazing. The riders are riding and it's time for us to get padded up and get into the action. We're now up at the top of the course. We're gonna hit it for the first time. It's not that scary, because we're gonna follow Tom Eisted who's already done it. So, are you ready for some action? I am, for sure, indeed. Let's get into it. You Go on Eisted. Silent. <laughs> Here we go. Ebing. Oh, clean them. Oh my God. I almost landed on them two on the landing. That was way too much. Right, first run then, I got kind of compressed on the lip and almost oh, landed for, on them two thanks kids. for pulling us. Yeah, I was just following him. That was, a, flips and stuff. Yeah. <laughs> that was a scary first drop in. So for today, I'm on the e-bike, the high bike, all mountain. Because it's good, I can get loads of laps in, get used to the course. And then throughout the week, I'm gonna change onto different bikes. But today I'm even it and loving it, apart from almost killing those kids there. Let's get into another lap. Go on then, Daryl. Yeah. Oh, sharky. Flipping his way around. See if I can get a flip on the go. Oh my God, I went so big on that then. Woo! That's sick. That is insane. Come on then, Max. See some action. Wow, I'm well close. Boom! Oh, yes. Oh, dreams. Oh. oh, flip tuck. Yeah. So fun, man. 
I've got a fun idea. Yeah. We switch each other's GoPro so we can film ourselves, ah, you know? All right, let's do what that. What a great idea. Yeah. Bing, bing. We've now got the following skills of Max. Yeah. Don't expect too much, people. I think I, I think I follow well. Yeah. That was well cool. cool. Sick flips. Thank you very much. And not there, I was following behind. Yeah. Getting action. Lucas Knopf on course. Oh yes. Oh my god. Getting so BMX on course. Gefährlich. Just get another flip at the first one. Covered him in dirt. Off the drop. Ooh. That was epic. Right, that is the end of day one. We've dialed in the slope style line and hopefully tomorrow it's gonna dry up so we can get a bit more action on the rest of the course. That has been an epic day with some flips and some spins. Max Fredrickson has also made a video from today, so his link's in the description if you want some different angles of what's been going on today. But that is unfortunately the end of the video, so I hope you guys enjoyed it. That'd be awesome if you leave some comments and be sick if you subscribe. See you in the next one. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> my